Um, you know, so you're welcome to Ravenswell Farm. We're very lucky. We moved here um, properly probably just over two years ago. Um, we've got 86 horses here. Um, I think we probably saw 82, 82 horses canter this morning. Uh, there's four gone off racing, so um, everything else is, is doing, doing, doing some work. Everything is, everything is sort of here. You know, we're just up to the round gallop, school and strips just next to that. The hill gallop is just another field away. So um, I'm glad to see you are impressed with our wildflower meadow yes, that we've it just- It amazing. That Can't wait to see it when it flowers. <laughs> if it flowers. <laughs> I started training uh, uh, 10 years ago, October uh, 2011. I started training, so just, just 10 years, and um, we've been, yeah, we've been using Denji products probably for eight of those years now, and it's, you know, it's been so reliable for us. And like you say, it's, it's just to be able to open the bag and know, know have the knowledge to know that what, what you, ho what you hope's in there will be in there, uh, week in, week out, is, 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 is great, yeah. So when we're working with National Hunt horses, um, they have a really long competitive career. How do you use Alpha A to help maintain them? Um, Alpha A we find is a great, um, firstly a buffer for, for, um, for gastric ulcers um, and it also uh, gives us uh, added potassium and stuff in their food and things like that. And we think it's, it's a, great recovery, a great recovery food, um, so we give it before and after their races on, on, a, day, on a race day. So okay. they, they will, they, we will take Alpha A with us to the to races. So they'll, they'll have it two hours before uh, races, and then um, fifteen or twenty minutes before they, they travel back home. Um, so yeah, it's it's it's, and that's all we think really is, is is great for their recovery. And it you know we find that once they've had the once we started using Alpha A after racing, um, we found that they ate up a lot better when they came back home from from a race. And what about um, things like loose droppings, digestive upsets? Do you have is that a common problem here for you? Or um, it, it, it was um, um, when we were on our old feed, and then we started using the Alpha A, and that definitely sort of binded things up a lot. Mm -hmm. um, and that no, they, they would all be pretty normal now. Yeah, so it's 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 very good for things like that as well. Yeah, and do you add some to every feed as well, and on yeah. a daily basis? Yeah, we would have. Um, they would probably have three quarters of a scoop of nuts in the morning, and a, a, a quarter of a scoop of alpha, and then they'd have the same at, at lunchtime, and then we would have uh, a full scoop or yeah, full scoop at night. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we, we feed quite a bit of it. But we still find that the alpha A is is, is very good. To, to for the potassium and the calcium, it's, it's very good to top up that, yeah. and um, which is also very important for us. Yeah, yeah. Um, calcium in the alpha alpha is really bioavailable, so the horse can absorb it much more easily. Yeah, and we find it's very palatable. You know, we've we've got very few horses that w won't eat the alpha A. Yeah. Um, and look, and they, they all look very well. He's been around the yard this morning. The horses look well. We don't we don't use any other supplements or additives. We don't use another oil or anything. The alpha, the alpha A is what, is what we use yeah. because it's got the, the, the extra oil and stuff in it. Yeah, so we, we find it, that that does the job for us. It's obviously very important that we know it's coming from field to feed. Um, so that that's hugely important to us as well. Yeah.